Today's topic is on product of two graphs and this is the most important topic from graph theory. In this video, I'll give you a clear cut idea on how to make a product of two graphs. So let us consider two graphs. So let G1 and G2 be two graphs. So G1 contains the vertex at V1 and edges at E1 whereas G2 graph contains the vertex at V2 and the edges at E2. Now the product of G1 and G2 will be denoted by G1 cross G2 and is defined as follows. See here, now let us consider two points that is u is equal to u1 u2, v is equal to v1 v2 in v is equal to v1 cross v2. Then u and v are said to be adjacent in G1 cross G2. If u and v should be adjacent in the product graph, then it should satisfy two conditions. See first one, if u1 is equal to v1, then in the graph u1 should be adjacent to v2. Then we can make an adjacent graph. Next, if u2 is equal to v2, if these two are equal, then we have to check u1, v1. If u1 is adjacent to v1, then we can make an edge with the cross product that is the product of the graphs so with an example i'll explain you so this is an example for the product of two graphs so in the first graph it contains that is two vertex vertices so in the graph one it contains u1 and u2 and in the graph g2 it contains three vertices v1 v2 and v3 so the vertices in g1 is u1 u2 and the vertices in g2 are v1 v2 v3 and next the number of edges so the number of edges in the graph g1 is 1 and the number of edges in graph g2 are 2 next we have to make a product of the vertices among g1 and g2 the first in first uh, graph we have u1 u2 see here in the first graph we we have the vertices u1 u2 and in the second graph we have v1 v2 v3 so if i make a cross product then this will be u1 v1 u1 v2 u1 v3 see here u1 v1 u1 v2 u1 v3 and next one u2 v1 u2 v2 u2 v3 so these are all the vertices or the points that is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So, with, uh, with uh, the help of these points or the vertices, so I am going to create a product of two graphs. So, here the vertices are 6. And see here, now there is a condition here. See, now we have to use all these. 1, 2, 3, 4 and 5. So, u1, v1, u2, v2, u3, v3. And these are all the points. Now I have to plot all these points. That is 1, 2, 3. This is 1, 2, 3. Total 6 points. Now the points here are U1, V1. See first check this one is U1. This is V1. And next one this is U1, V2. Next one U1, V2. The third point here is this is U1. This is V3. And next if you see this is uh, U2. This is u2 v1, this is uh, u2 v2 and next one this is u2, this is v3, u2 v3. So these are the six points and now we have to make a product graph. So how we have to make a product graph? See here, if u1 is equal to if u1 is equal to u2, we have to check v1, v2. See, it is a condition that if u1 is equal to v1, so we have to find out whether u2 is adjacent to v2. Adjacency is nothing but side by side. So, v1, v2. So, v1, v2 are adjacent to each other. Therefore, we can make an edge with this. So, now I am going to make an edge with this. So, now I can make an edge with this. So, next one, if you check u1 and u2. So, check these two. u1 equal to again u1. So, u1 equal to u. u1, u3. Check u1, u3. They are not adjacent to each other. So, we can't make an edge with this two points. Next, check this. u1, u1. So, these two are same. If these two are same, then we have to check u2, v2 are adjacent or not. Check v2, v3. So, v2, v3 are side by side adjacent 
vertices. Now I can make a edge with this product graph. And next check here u1 v1 and u2 v2 here v1 v2 are same v1 v1 are same now we have to check u1 u2 whether they are adjacent or not u1 u2 are adjacent to each other therefore we can make an edge with this product graph and next to see here check these two so these are not equal u1 u2 v1 v2 leave those so next one here um, it is u1 See here, here it is u1, u2, u2. So these two are same. Then we have to check v1, v2. So v1, v2 are adjacent in this graph and therefore the, com the condition is applied. Therefore we can take an edge with this. Next one, see here, check these two, u2 and u2. See here, u2 equal to u2. So th in this point, if u2 equal to u2, we have to check v1, v3. Are they adjacent? V1, V3, are they adjacent? No, they are not adjacent. So, we can't take a edge like this. So, we have to go with this. U2 is equal to U2. So, check U2, V3. So, U2, V3 are side by side. They are adjacent to each other. Therefore, we can take a edge in this product graph. And next, see here, in this U1, U2, and this is u1 u3 this is u2 u3 so v3 v3 are same here then we have to go with this two u1 u2 so u1 u2 are side by side adjacent vertices therefore the condition holds we can take a vertex and next see check these two check these two they are not equal they are not similar at all so here u1 equal to u2 check these two so v1 equal to v2 so, these two are same. If these two are same, we have to check these two. U1, U2. Are they adjacent in this graph? In this graph G1. So, this is G2 and this is G1 cross G2. So, here V2, V2 are same. Therefore, U1, U2 you have to check. They are adjacent. Therefore, we can take an edge with this. So, this is how we have to um, make the product and this is nothing but g1 product g2 or g1 cross g2 and this is how we have to draw and this is also very simple so first of all we have to check the points u1 equal to u2 and next we have to verify whether they are adjacent or not if they are adjacent if uh, the two points holds if they are uh, u1 equal to u2 the first point holds then we have to check the second point that is v1 adjacent to v2 if they are adjacent in the graph so you can make an edge with this so you can take an edge in the product graph therefore this is how we can make a graph with the product so this is the product of two two graphs hope you all guys understand if you understand this video please pass it on to your friends subscribe to this channel and promote this channel thank you so much